I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Hey, welcome back to FuckTube. Mmm. What? <laughs> <laughs> You gotta clear these name changes with me, boo. Alright, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Are you okay with Fucktube? Yeah, I mean, of course I am. Alright, welcome back to Fucktube. Welcome back. Uh, I'm climbing a ladder right now. There's some guys. I don't know. <laughs> Could you... I mean, tell me what's going on right here. I don't know. I mean, we have horse people in this uh, game. It's not like we needed... I, I, it's not that they're horse people that weirds me out. It's just the visual. Like, what? what is... Oh, God. Yeah, I'm I know. So Clearly, fuck. it's 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 upset you. Because you had to... Get the, <laughs> Get the fuck out of Dodge. Get the fuck out of Dodge. Has anybody ever used that unironically? Oh, yeah, I say it constantly. Really? If, like, yeah. some police, some popo are coming, you're like, Get the fuck out of Dodge, bro! Oh, no, no. In that case, I'm just like, Oh, God! <laughs> Eat whatever you have in your hands! <laughs> it's like poo-poo. Oh, why did you have that? Because, I don't know. Yeah. Collecting poo poo? Shit gets you high. <laughs> yeah, literally. Oh, dude, is that. Does that dragon have like a red neck pouchy thing? Yeah, that's where he's vul vulnerable. Vulnerable. Yeah. I... What's with all the bombs, bro? Yeah. It's... Do we need them for some reason? No, man. They just show up and they explode, man. They're just there to make your life miserable. Cool. There's all these bombs! Where are they coming from? Yeah, I don't know. Why are they there, bro? Shitty town. Oh, all right. You can hit those fuckers anyway. Oh god. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that. Uh... Oh, this is interesting. Yeah, it it, it really makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> it's, it is a little nerve wracking somehow. Like maybe these won't do it. <laughs> yeah. No, they they do. It's just if you if you hit them like below where they fuck. If you hit them below where they're mm. supposed to be hit, mm -hmm. then you just die uh... because you don't fall with them. Like you fall faster than they do. I see. But if you if you hit them above. Whatever. Yeah, I know. The no, point I, is, you I, have I, to be I, careful. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> what? It, the I point is, it takes a steady <laughs> hand and a lot of talent. Whoops. I was actually considering uh, breaking the the because okay, this is what like the second episode of the of the second playthrough we've had of this game. Right. In between those two playthroughs, mm -hmm. I uh, I replayed this game on the Nintendo disc. Oh, okay. Um, which I which I didn't have. I, I beat this game on I believe Steam, the first time I beat it. I see. But then I beat it on the Nintendo disc because I was on a, a plane, uh. and uh, motherfucker, I did a, a no checkpoint playthrough. No where, shit. Where you blow up all the checkpoints. Yeah, it was it was fucking hard as fuck. It was actually really easy up until a stage that we haven't gotten to yet. No shit, and you have to start the entire game over. We well, have to start the entire stage over. That's and these stages are like ridiculously long. Yeah, brutality. So and and plus that stage is filled with a bunch of fucking bullshit <laughs> that I'm sure will uh, <laughs> we'll experience firsthand. Fantastic. So they know what stage I'm talking about. Do they? Yeah, motherfucking. Uh, <laughs> you know what you did. No, I'm talking about the popo night. Uh, you know, talking night? about the popo night. <laughs> nah, you'll know. You'll see. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll get to him, and you'll be like. Motherfucker, this stage sucks my nards. <laughs> my nards. Yeah. Wolfman's got nards. Wolfman? Do you remember that? No. Oh, it's from Monster Squad. That's like the classic line of that movie. If, if, if the hell is Monster Squad? Oh, I think you'd like it. It's it's from it's from the 80s. It's it's kind of like it was kind of like what Goonies was, except more horror based and less um, adventure based. It was a movie. Um, and, uh, yeah, I should have, I should have led with that. It, it was a movie. Right, let me start. <laughs> Your confused silence leads me to believe perhaps I should begin at the beginning. Um, but yeah, uh, the classic line from it is, like, they're being attacked by Wolfman, and one, one kid is cornered, so the other kid yells to him, like, kick him in the nards! And he's like, Wolfman doesn't have nards! He's like, do it! And then they kick him in the nuts! And, uh, he's like, Wolfman's got nards! Oh, so he does indeed have nards. Oh, yeah, they, he, Man. like, he doubles right over. That's some M. Night Shyamalan twistage right there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, except it's not terrible. You don't think- oh, oh, shit, dude, we're gonna get so much fan mail. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Is there truly anyone who would defend M. Night Shyamalan at this point? No. I can't think of one person I know. I think anybody who ever would is already at the stage of, like, yeah, Unbreakable and Sixth Sense were good, but... Oh, yeah. I don't know what happened. Yeah, I don't know either. I've never seen such a, like, a, an insanely precipitous drop from anybody. Yeah, drugs. Yeah, pff, could Tra be. Traffic. Who, um... Uh... 
What the heck was I gonna say? Oh, oh yeah, uh, the last Avatar. You've seen it, right? The last Airbender. That's the one. It, it, based on Avatar. Jesus, I yeah. always do that. Um, one of the worst movies I've ever seen. Oh yeah, I've only ever seen clips from it, but I, I immediately like was like, ah, I don't know if I want to finish this. Do you know how much money that movie made? Two. Two, uh, two dollars? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, two cents. Yeah. Uh, ah, okay. You know, all right. <laughs> yeah, I thought I was gonna die there. I, <laughs> I believe, and I could be wrong on the actual numbers, but it's very close to this. With international sales and everything, mm -hmm. something in the ballpark of like three hundred and fifty million dollars. Is that it was a bad? mega success. Really? Yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> Does it make you feel good about your life choices? Wait, 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 wait. Really? Yeah, yeah. Because internet, it was a huge international hit, despite its shocking three percent Rotten Tomatoes rating. <laughs> it was like, wow. That's a movie full of exposition. I'll tell you that. Yeah. Everybody that, talks in like paragraphs. That whole movie was exposition. Yeah. Shit. I'm sorry. I tell me that. all about this. But don't show me. Don't yeah. give me any action. We have to go to the thing. All right, we're going to the thing. We've gotten to the thing, but it's the thing that we have to do is not the thing that we're. It's like, oh god. My favorite is Stop. like he's like looking for his family and he shows the dude the picture that he has of them and it's like some like crayon shit that a kindergartner would draw. <laughs> <laughs> this is like the worst picture. Dude, we should watch that together, you and me. I would do it. Um, do you no, think no one else? We oh. should invite nobody else. Cool. It would be really unprofessional of us to invite anybody else. If we, <laughs> it would ruin our dynamic. To Agreed. Be perfectly honest. Agreed. Do you think if we watched a movie like that and recorded us just like being idiots over it, that people would watch it? Yeah, but we wouldn't be able to put it on the internet. Oh, is that right? Yeah. How does like riff tracks do it? They just they release uh, an MP3. And then they tell you how to sync it up to oh, a DVD release. Oh, that's genius. Yeah. Those guys are so smart. Yeah, there are, um... There are people that, uh, do release, like, pirated copies with the, the audio over it. Oh, cool. Like, they do it for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, which is cool, and, uh, you know... I'm not gonna say I downloaded one of them or anything, nope, but nope. I never downloaded one of them. <laughs> it doesn't... It, <laughs> that's, that's illegal. Dude, I love it when he's... <laughs> <laughs> when those wolves go nuts. Um, yeah, that is illegal, so cool of you not to do that ever. Yeah, I would never ever do that. That's that's probably one of the worst things that you could possibly do. It just, it ruins the economy, honestly. You know, you know what? And I'm being like fully honest right now. I have never in my life pirated music. Really? Yeah. Be, well, but, like, I'm also like of a, of a generation that like bought CDs, you know? And like, so I was never used to the idea of like, Music should be free for all, you know? Oh. I pirated the shit out of music. I mean... <laughs> it's fine. Dude, I mean, like, that's 90... I'm not saying I'm, like, a better human being than anyone else. Well... It's just... I, it's... If you're saying it, just own up to it. <laughs> 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 I'm not. Well, because I, like, I fucking did music, too, and I was like, Boy, I wish everyone would stop stealing this. I, I could stop living in a car. Oh, yeah, I definitely had, um... I had that feeling back in the day. Because I was like, I was like, man, I really think that music should be free for everybody, because that's what art is. And then I was like, but if I want to make this my living, I would rather that people pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I would rather be able to make it a living. Yeah, and that's why well, that's what was cool about YouTube was like you could just put it up there for free, and it was like, hey, all right. Yeah, absolutely. As opposed to charging people, because I mean that was an option at one point. It was like. I was planning on making a DVD of, like, awesome cartoons that weren't available anywhere but the DVD. Right, right, right. And that was gonna be how I was gonna make money. But then YouTube came along. Well, it's interesting, you know, cause, like, I'm sure... I'm, I'm sure, no matter what you do, as long as, uh... It's monetized, like, somebody's going to call you a sellout and all that shit. Oh, yeah. But, I mean... Cause, why, why should artists, um... Why should you be able to make a living at what you work hard on? And, and eat food. <laughs> yeah. And, and have a, a comfortable living. It's, you know, I don't, I don't know. I don't want to get all fucking preachy or anything. But it, it's, it's. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, he is like. Oh, oh. Uh, uh, mm. Go on, preach on. No, no, yeah, it's just very easy to call. And I mean, I certainly did it when I was like a, e like a teenager filled with emotions. <laughs> 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 like, I'd be like, man, this band was so much better when, like, they weren't popular, blah, all that shit. But, I mean, 
as you get older, you, you realize it's very easy to call someone a sellout when, like, your mom and dad are paying for everything. <laughs> you, oh, yeah. you, and, like, you're, co you're in college and everything's taken care of. And, and a lot harder to do it when, like, you know, you have medical bills and, like, all, all this other shit you never even think of as a, when you're younger. Oh, you yeah. Um, so I, I, I've become a lot more, like, yeah, man, fucking take care of yourself. Yeah. There's like a famous Henry Rollins video where he like rants about that. Mm -hmm. Where he's like, uh, there's a lot of like indie bands that like end up getting the car commercial or whatever, you know? Right. And then people call him a sellout and he's like, he's like, these dudes are making money with their art? What a bunch of sellouts! <laughs> like, and it's like, ha yeah, Henry Rollins, you're awesome. <laughs> I, I, I do like him a lot. It, it's, it's, it is weird. Yeah, he was being sarcastic. Oh, by the way. of course. I, I don't know course. if I conveyed that as, <laughs> yeah. as well as I should have. Well, it's funny too because like when <coughs> when I was a kid, I can't remember if I said this once before, but like when I was when I was younger, like if you saw a band on a commercial, that was your first instinct. You were like, oh, that band's a sellout. They're on a commercial. Blah blah blah. And now I have to fucking think of like Nissan every time I hear this song. But like now. The main way I find out about new bands is when they appear yeah, on commercials, yeah. you know? Like, just everything's changed so, so much. I agree. And you know what else I agree on? What's that? Next time on Game Grumps. Oh, Grimms, man. We're gonna have... A grand old time! Yeah. More preaching from aged men. <laughs> <laughs> What's a YouTube? <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> Ow. I try to pause it, but I couldn't. <laughs> no problem. You did great. Thanks. I tried my hardest, and in the end, it doesn't even matter. Uh...